You guys want some more questions? Yes, so here we go, part two. Let's get this party started. How's it going, guys? Hope you're all having a fantastic day. My name is Lee Sinker. I'm a variety stream from the West Coast of Australia. Out here trying to put a smile on people's faces, trying to make the world a better place, even if it's just one person at a time. And here we are answering another bunch of questions from you guys that you guys have sent me over the past few days. Finally, oh my god, finally, with another fucking video. Jesus Christ, that took forever, didn't it? But let's get this party started. So, we're gonna start with a question from my buddy, Bogan Ozzy. Quite a few questions, actually, not just one. <clears throat> and he quests, You've talked about this before, but in your opinion, what makes or breaks a streaming platform? If you could make one, what would it be called? How would you have it run it? And who would it be on it? So that's actually a difficult one to answer right off the bat, obviously. I don't think I could actually make my own stream platform, but let's suppose that I could. I would just try to enforce the rules as best as I can, to be honest. Try to keep it fair for everyone. Not take favorites, like a, a certain company that we know. <laughs> as much as I love it. Uh, would you have moved to Mixer should you have had the opportunity? I don't know. Uh, if I knew that Mixer was going to be shutting down, I definitely wouldn't even consider switching to it. But at the time, I actually thought about switching to Mixer at one point. Maybe thought it would actually be in a better platform to actually stream on. But unfortunately, as we've seen, that wasn't actually the case. So it's a good thing that I actually stuck to Twitch. Uh, we've seen what Mixer did well in the past, but what could it have made it better? Not shutting down. <laughs> Zero Two Kitty's asking, why are you terrified of horror games and have you tried doing a horror game video in the past? So, I'm terrified of horror games because my dumbass, this dumbass is here, this dumbass right over here, I decided, hey, let's, uh, let's watch The Exorcist at the age of five. Totally not gonna have any adverse effects, like literally having nightmares for the fucking rest of the month. But, yeah, it wasn't, um, it wasn't a nice experience, so that's one of the reasons why I actually have a lot of fear of horror movies nowadays horror movies and horror games and whatnot, because every time I deal with horror, I literally shit the bed. Kurosaki's asking, what's your favorite anime? So my favorite anime is actually, I got three of them. I got Parasite, The Maxim, I got Dragon Ball, any Dragon Ball, and My Hero Academia. By far my top favorite three, honestly, love them to bits. My buddy Charles is asking, AMD or Intel? AMD. Fuck Intel. <laughs> How do you feel knowing that you brought so many amazing people together? Honestly, there is no better feeling in the world Especially when I wake up in the morning, the first thing I see is a message from someone saying that I made their day better. It's honestly a blessing to wake up and actually seeing so many amazing, kind and supportive messages and people telling me that like, you know, this community has made them feel so much better and it has helped them when they're going through times of, um, to a lot of shit. It, it, it really does make my day. It really does make my day knowing that I was able to make some people happy and make a positive impact in their lives and i couldn't ask for anything else singer you watch jojo right what's your favorite part uh that one for uh for obvious reasons oh my god synchro's a perv <laughs> when you started streaming what was the first game and thing that you streamed and what are you like off streams so when i first started streaming my ever first stream was apex legends and I pretty much used to play with a group of friends and whatnot and act stupid together. We had a lot of funny moments as well. I actually miss Apex Legends for that exact reason because the game itself is boring when you're alone, but when you have friends and a good amount of banter and whatnot, it is absolutely hilarious. And it was actually a game that I used to play all the fuck. What am I like off stream? Um, not really different from what you see me on stream. Uh, I have a lot of depression that I deal with outside of stream that I don't want to people to have to see. Uh, I want people to see me at the peak of my game when I'm actually happy and, you know, making other folks happy. TLDR, uh, I'm usually the same person you see me on camera, outside of the camera. There's not a lot that changes. How long did it take you to be able to stream on just chatting and what your first streams like? So I think I had around about 10 to 12 viewers when I first started doing just chatting streams and all that it was at the time was sound request streams So basically we usually just sit down listen to songs together talk about stuff We used to get diverse topics that we could segue into and go on from there um, But other than that not It was it was a very small number. It was just the fact that my chat was really active at the time uh, Even with a small number my very first streams were a little bit something like this though sword flying Booger, oh, booger, me make fire. We'll see you in a lake, you trees. Oh. Am I that undeserving of a bullet to my head? It's yours now, motherfucker. No. You're lucky. What are you gonna do, huh? What are you gonna do, yeah? <laughs> Come back here. Are you dying? <laughs> what the fuck? You fucking motherfucker! But yeah, um, 
kind of missed though sometimes. The rest of the camera is asking me, okay, how much stress and how do you overcome it when you're streaming or recording? So there's a lot of stress uh, in particular when you're streaming, not so much when I'm recording, but more so when I'm streaming. And a lot of the stress comes from the fact that I'm scared of failure. And I think that's the same thing with a lot of people. We're scared of failure. I used to have panic attacks before I even hit the live button on my streams every single time. And that's where the stress a lot of the times comes from. You get a lot of stress thinking that like, I'm not gonna make it, my stream is gonna be shit. Everyone's gonna be disappointed. Even when I'm worried about things, my community has done nothing but be incredibly lovely and supportive to me and I fucking love these guys uh, for recording videos though I fucking hate recording videos not a fun task not a fun task at all do your friends and family IRL know a lot about your streaming career so my mom and dad know everything about my streaming career mostly because they're incredibly supportive about it they want to see me make it far with it uh, they always have my back they've actually made cameo appearances on my stream as well, my mom literally popping in to say hello a bunch of times and just hanging out and saying hello to the chat, or my dad literally coming in and actually just doing push-ups with me on stream. A lot of people know, a lot of people know, a lot of friends know as well, a lot of them think it's bullshit, uh, but there's also the majority of them which are supportive of it, seeing how far I've gone with it and just want to see the best for me. So that's it for these questions guys, honestly, I hope you enjoyed this quick video. Wait, hold up, just a little more question. Deceived or befriend. How are you today? I'm good, my friend. Thank you for asking. <laughs> Love you, pal. Thank you so much for watching the video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Honestly, I hope I managed to answer some of your questions. Honestly, I can't thank you guys enough for being such a loving and supporting community. I can't wait to see you guys another time. I stream just about every day, Monday to Saturday, starting at 4 p.m. Australian West Standard Time. I'd love to see you guys there. Thank you so much for all the continued love and support, guys. You guys are absolutely phenomenal, and I'll catch you next time. See you then.